Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys the OR gate which I haven't shown in my channel. So this is the OR gate schematic diagram in front of you guys. In this schematic diagram you can see there are two inputs. Uh, this is A, this is the input A and B, this is the this is the another input. There are two inputs here. We can see there are two inputs and uh, there is one output which is the X. So this is the OR gate schematic diagram. Now I'm gonna use the Tinkercad to make a schematic diagram. So let's dive into it. So first of all I need a breadboard. Whenever I'm using Tinkercad, first, the first thing that I have to get is the breadboard. I'm gonna grab all the components. I need LED resistor. I need battery. I need a nine volt battery, or you could just get a power supply. Today I'm gonna show you guys with the power supply. Here's the power supply. It's very easy with the power supply. You don't have to get the regulator. So the negative is going to be connected with the negative is going to be black. Positive with the positive is going to be red. So as I got this resistors, I need to put it here. So it has to be a 330 ohms resistor that I'm going to use. And I'm going to copy this here. So first of all, to make sure my breadboard is working, I have to connect the positive with the positive where negative where with the negative, which is going to be black and the positive where is going to be red. Now I have to, I got the battery, I wear the breadboard. As I said in my schematic diagram, I have two inputs. Therefore, I have to get two resistors, which are 330 ohms, 330 ohms resistors. Right now, I have to get a switch. I'm going to use a dip switch. So, uh, let me make sure it's where with the switch. So, the first one, had the switch has to be connected with the power. I'm going to use both the switch because both the, I have two inputs. Right now, I need to get a chip, which is the most important, OR gate chip. So if I just search up OR gate, I'm going to see uh, they have quad OR gate. So for OR gate, we use 7432 chip. So I'm going to connect it in the middle of the breadboard. Now, as I can see on the chip, the ground is right here. Let me zoom in. This is the ground. So I'm going to connect the ground with the negative. This is the negative and make it black. This is the power. This is the positive. So I'm going to connect the positive with the positive. Red. Let me zoom out. Next, I have to make sure that I have two in resistors. I have to connect with two inputs. I have an input here, so I'm going to connect with the first resistor. There is another input, and I'm going to connect it with the second resistor. So, so far, I have drawn the two inputs. This is one input. There is another input, and I have one output. So I have to make sure I get another resistor for the output. So I'm going to connect it here. And I need LED. Where's my LED? It's right here. I'm going to connect anode with the re resistor and the cathode with the ground, which is black. And right now, as I have word, this is the output. This resistor is for the output. So I have to connect it with the output of the chip. This is the IC chip, 7432. So I'm going to connect it with the output. Here's the output. I'm going to connect it here, or I could just connect it there. 
like this. I'm going to make it orange. So this is my complete or gate. So let me start the simulation to check if my wearings are correct and my light is working. Or get, as I said, is output is on when at least one input is on. Let me check. If this input is on, light is on. This input is on, light is on. So my circuit is working well. Both inputs are on, lights are on. Both inputs are gone, off, I mean. Lights is off. This is how the OR gate works. Output is on when at least one input is on. So at least one input is on, is on. At least one input is on, is on. Both inputs are on, is going to be on. Both are off, is going to be off. So this is how the OR gate works. I hope if you guys like my video, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.